2022 is over, and what a year it has been. I stated on Instagram in the beginning of the year that 2022 would be my year. And oh boy, was I right. For me, the year started out in the studio where I spent most of my time working with my new band, Ready. I had a small break doing Denmark's Insamling, where we collected over 100 million for the children in poor countries. It was also the year where the TV show Stjana i Troen was aired. Here, Denmark saw a different side of me six Fridays in a row. Mmm, yeah. And then March arrived, and we participated in the biggest music contest in Denmark for Eurovision Song Contest, Dansk Melodi Grand Prix. Which we won! I get butterflies in my stomach whenever I think of this moment. Having to prepare for Eurovision was one of the most intense moments of my life. This is my second time doing Eurovision. I also did it in Azerbaijan back in 2012. With Ready, we toured Europe to promote the song. We went to London, Amsterdam, and Madrid. Truly a dream come true. And then, of course, Torino in Italy, where Eurovision was being held. We were there for 14 days and I had the best time performing in front of over 60 million people on live TV across Europe. After our adventure in Torino, I returned home and was asked to host Crown Princess Mary in my hometown alongside with my brother. So we did, and we put on a great show on live TV. This year was also Liga's 10 years anniversary, which is so crazy to me. And as if the timing couldn't have been better, our album went platinum and we could celebrate with both a festival tour and an acoustic tour. And apparently I needed more royal stuff this year. I was asked by the artist Iris Gold to play with her in front of the Royal Highness herself, the Queen of Denmark celebrating her 50 years on the throne as the country's monarch. The documentary I shot in Morocco and Paris about the female rappers aired on TV and in schools this year as well. I'm so glad it's finally out. And like this year couldn't get any better, I was awarded an appreciation grant by the Danish Musicians and Songwriters Guild DPA in front of the best musicians and songwriters we have in Denmark. I couldn't believe it. This year I also got to take my parents on a luxurious vacation in Turkey and I got to go to Amsterdam and Paris with my best friends where we visited Disneyland for the first time. And to top everything off and starting the year right, I'm moving away from my small apartment and into a huge house New Year's Day. What a year it has been. I'm so thankful for the life I've got. I'm living my dream every single day and it's truly an adventure. I cannot wait to tell you about the things I've got planned for next year. I know I've said it before, but 2023 will too be my year. Happy New Year, guys! Bye! Bye!